Neil. Hey guys, good morning. It's about five in the evening, actually. Oh my gosh, the sleep felt so good. My arm wouldn't even fully extend yesterday. It was in so much pain, so stiff. Sleep really is the true remedy for all that. Because, wow, my arm feels great this morning. I'm totally ready for another workout today. Jenny and I doing our morning routine. In this case, five in the afternoon routine. Taking the honey. Honey. Taking the honey for her morning walk. Again, morning is a relative term here. Alrighty, catch up with you guys later. Hey guys, Jenny and I just finally got done with our first bike ride in over a month. We bought the bikes to get fit, we rode them for a few days and then we hadn't ridden them in about a month since we moved in here a few weeks ago and a couple weeks before that. So, I think it wiped us both out. Is this what I see on your head? <laughs> I need water. I got sweat going on. So, good workout. Good workout. We finished it with a race around the complex, around the apartment complex, going in opposite directions. And Jenny's excuse is a car got in her way. But I won. We'll give her the benefit of the doubt and call it a no contest. We'll see what happens next time. I'm beat though. I was going to do some more filming while we were out on the cell phone, but after I did those two videos on the cell phone, um, the phone was full on memory. Alrighty, laters. Hey guys, after us each having a protein shake and cooling down a little bit, uh, we're now possibly, maybe, enjoying a post-workout cigarette and heading down to the grocery store to stock up on eggs and milk. Laters. Hey guys, just got out of the market. We went there officially for milk and eggs and came out, well, it's in the trunk, but we came out with like $50 worth of groceries. $50 we really didn't have to spend, but oh well. We needed the food, so we got some good stuff. Hey guys. So, we've been back from the store for a little bit now. And I already made a double cheeseburger that was That's awesome. What, I put it last time. what? The lavender. You put lavender in it? Yeah, remember? Oh. Was that good? Was bad? It was okay, but it was like a whole different dish. It definitely took really? over and was very strong with the lavender. But that made it so good. It was like my secret. Did you want to put a little pinch in there to try to add some lavender flavor. Oh, and it was also in it, like yeah. you, you were eating the lavender. Yeah, that That's, was bad. Yeah, you, you like eating the little lavender bits? I thought it was good. I mean, the flavor's good, I'm just okay, saying. Huh? Yeah. Please only do a little bit. Yeah. It already smells so amazing. It's going to change the whole flavor profile. Anyway, um, I already made myself a double cheeseburger with some raw beef. It was freaking delicious. And right now, Jenny is making some kind of lavender beef stroganoff over here. Should be tasty. And when we were in the store, we saw this tuna that was only like 69 cents a can. And is it going to focus? Focus? No focus? Oh, well, trust me when I say that it says 13 grams of protein. Um, I'm really confused at why it's not focusing, but anyway, 13 grams of protein in half this small can of tuna. So that means in the whole can there's 26 grams of protein for 69 cents. That is unbelievably cheap protein. I had something else to say. can't remember what though. I'm sure it'll come back to me. Keep you posted on how this tasty dish comes together. Good onions. Laters. Goodbye. Hey guys. Meal's almost done. 
Um, Jenny tried a new method that she read about online to cook pasta in a frying pan. It said that it obviously uses way less water, and she's already drained it, but you actually... I didn't have to drain it at all. I thought you said it leaves enough. No. no it all went away? Yep. You cooked it away? Yeah. Oh. Well, one of the perks of it was that it was supposed to leave you with enough pasta water stuff in the pan to be able to make a, you know, to have a thickening agent. I don't know if you guys can hear over the water, but um, I will show you in a few minutes when it's fully plated. She's having hers with pasta, I'm having mine a little unorthodox with couscous. Either way, it's going to be some delicious beef stroganoff. Alrighty guys, this is the finished product. It looks so funky. Jenny's is pasta, beef stroganoff, and mine is couscous beef stroganoff. Can't wait to dig into it. Looks delicious. Delicious. Laters. Goodbye. All right, guys. Can't believe I even remembered to do a good night video. It's about 8:30 in the morning. We've been watching Walking Dead, and we are ready to pass out. Good night, guys.